Let's solve the following problem using the quadratic formula. So what we're going to do now is we'll plug everything into this. And then we have a, a, b, c, the constants in front of the variables. All right, so b is going to be 5 plus, excuse me, negative 5, opposite, plus or minus square root of b squared, which is going to be 25, minus 4 times a, which is 1, times c, which is negative 6, all over 2 times a, which is just 1. So we have negative 5 plus or minus the square root of 25 plus 24 all over 2. So let me get um, plus or minus 49 square root all over 2. So we get... Alright, so then what we do here is we have negative 5 plus or minus 7 all over 2 which yields negative 12 over 2 and negative 5 plus 7 is going to be negative 2 all over 2. So we have negative 6 and negative 1. And that's it. All right. I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.